Seems like they just don't get our ways They try to control what we say Funny things will never go away It's who we are We drink iced tea out of jars We ride in trucks Put our time in at the farm Nothing wrong with little What's up? What's up? What is up, FS Club? Welcome back to the channel, guys. Well, we got some surprise mods. Okay, just to let everybody know, yes, mods did get released today, which is actually 10 new mods on console. We also got a few updates, uh, but everybody's asking, why is mods being released? I'm thinking mods are going to still be released during this break, because I also got news that the John Deere X9 has actually started testing. So, it might just mean that basically like giants themselves are on break, but the testers might be able to be working from home, getting some of these mods tested. So we might see mods during this break. So but anyways, today we got, let's see, the Feltrina MR4A, the New Holland T5 Series US, the PLN 535, which is not on the website. Uh, we also got the Vultra T-Force Pack, the Lizard T-2020-08, the Brussels and Laid Square Bell Tongs, the Sledge, buildings machinery sheds and the class baseline hd oh i'm awake i'm awake today hey how you doing a dub what's up buddy okay but anyways let's get into the map to take a look at these new mods which i am very interested in seeing this feltrina besides the whole dolly part yes i will be also live streaming tonight too guys all right let me get in here real quick go to our testing map uh let's see feltrino so I got to activate all these real quick. Uh, Derp will also be joining us in a second. Uh, I don't know if Sam or any of them are, but I know Derp is. I'm here. Oh, he's here too. <laughs> oh, thanks. <laughs> New Holland T5 <laughs> Series US. 
Uh, how you doing, CBW? I'm so happy. <laughs> Vulture T series. Okay, but Lizard two oh two. This was kind of unexpected today, so I wasn't expecting to do a new mod video, but uh, we're here, aren't we? Uh, let's see the two oh two. Trying to look for this one. Oh, there it is, right there. So we got actually a new conveyor today. Uh, Brussels unlaid square bale. Go all the way up. Yes, the John Deere X nine is entered testing, so maybe it might come out this week since you know mods are coming out. How awesome would that be? A Christmas mod right there. I'm just saying. Giant, set it up. Oh, uh, let's see. That would be pretty cool. Yeah, T, uh, T, uh, an X9? About to say T9. Yes. Uh, let's see. Sledge. <laughs> so we did get a sled today. Don't know how we're going to use that. But it'd be nice for decorations, it up though. To whatever. Uh, and can your you... friends can, like, you can put your friends on it and sled them around in the snow. You can hook it up? Yeah. What? Okay, yeah. let's see. Buildings. Uh, where's buildings at? You attach it to the vehicles. That's awesome right there. Now I just yeah. need some snow. Uh, buildings, machinery, sheds. Uh, it has a passenger script. Oh, okay. Does, it, does that mean that in multiplayer on console you can get into it? Maybe. I'm not for sure. Unless it's a PC thing only, maybe. I don't know. That would be nice. Okay, I'm looking for machine yeah. sheds. I keep passing it up. There it is. Uh, Class baseline HD, which I believe with that one, you need... Isn't that for precision farming? Let's see. Yes, that's for precision farming. Yes, that's for precision farming. So you need precision farming on the that one. Yeah. Okay, there's that. All right. Need the what do I need? The claws. Also, like I said, the PLN five thirty two is an unannounced uh, mod that's not on the website, so it is just a console mod. Oh, uh, the claws, 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 claws. Actually, got a lot of claws. Where the heck is it? There it is. Okay, and then the PLN. Hey, Jeff Reed, how you doing, buddy? Remember, guys, if you guys do like this stream, make sure you guys do hit that like button. We're up to 45 likes. Let's try to get up to 100 before the end. Uh, the PLN. There it is right there. Okay, so let's get into this. How you doing, Tyler? You're in school still, Russell? How are you still in school? This is Christmas week. Okay, I am actually on the Xbox showing these off. How you doing, James the Robot? Remember, guys, if you guys have not hit that sub button, make sure you guys do hit that sub button. We post videos every single day. Okay. So here we are. Let's take a look at the Feltrina first for today. You're in school. Everybody's still in school? My daughters are out of school. Wow. Jeez. They're out of school until, what, I think January 7th? Okay, so the Feltrina, and this one is made by SMI Modding. Uh, trailers, I like these trailers besides the whole Dolly part. But there they are right there, the MR4A. $55,000, 17 slots, holds up to 60,000 liters. So not bad on the liters. Uh, let's see, options on this one. Let's see, there might be only be one mod on Christmas, but no mods on Christmas Eve. Okay. Uh, Y'all school, that sucks. <laughs> Okay, let's see. We got the main color. We got the John Deere color, the JCB, Finch Red, Case IH, Mousy Ferguson, the New Holland Dutch, John Deere Yellow. Then we got the Fent New Green, Fent Old Green, Kloss, Agro, and then, of course, the Fent Black. I hate Dolly trailers. Get out of here with that, Charlie. Design color. We got the John Deere Yellow, JCB. I think it's pretty much the same. Yeah, it's pretty much the same. Capacity, though, we got the 47,500. We got the 60,000. And then back to the 47500s. Uh, can't live. Guys, stop picking on me. Jeez. I do an early stream and you guys have to pick on me. Okay, Will Brand, we have the Michelin. We have Trailborg. Michelin, you have Standard. XS. And then back to Standard Design. You have Standard. You have Double Lights. Where does the Double Lights go to? Try and look. Don't see nothing. Hmm. I don't know. Maybe the back? Yes, I'll get in the back right there. How you doing? It's Andrew. I was surprised of the stream. Yeah, this is how we're going to be doing the new mod showcases for a while. 
Uh, you can also put a cover on it too, so that's a plus. So a really nice little trailer right here. These early streams are rare. Well, they might not be rare because I actually like doing these early streams to showcase the mods. It's a little bit easier. And that way you guys can also, you know, ask questions if you need something answered or anything like that. So, okay. So that is the Faltrina. a couple of guests as well. Yeah. And get a couple of guests like, you know, Derp and everything. The ambassador for Giants. Hey, Derp. Hello. Okay. So that was the Feltrina MR4A. You know how much I love dollies. <laughs> Oh, sorry guys. I'm I'm still waking up a little bit. This was unexpected about these new mods. So, uh, just gave you a like. Thank you, John Brock. Okay, the next one is the New Holland T5 Series US. Okay. Uh, now with that trailer, if you put it on sixty thousand, can it still do regular cross or just silage? Uh, good question. Let's see. Go all the way back to it. It looks like it's pretty much any crop. Yeah, it's okay. any crop. Uh, okay. wakey, wakey, you know, eggs some of those are kind of egg kinda sounds on that really you... good right now, doesn't it? Well, maybe yeah. not. Maybe not to derp because it's probably like what, about four or five o'clock in the afternoon for you. Yeah. <laughs> Does breakfast sound good to you right now? I'll take it. <laughs> I'm still in school for two. See that? That's what I don't get. Why are you guys still in school? My daughters are out. Friday was their last day. It used to be, you know, you get like a week before, you know, Christmas when you got out. Okay, but anyways, here is the new Holland T5 Series US. Uh, let's see, 77,500, 20 slots, 120 horsepower is the base on it. Our school sucks. <laughs> Rim color, any color. Main color, you got pretty much new Holland blue, dot yellow, dot orange, dot white, new Holland red, blue candy, red candy, black. What's up with the candies? Okay, uh, let's see. Configuration, you got standard. Come on, stop doing that. How you doing, Marshall? 225 kilogram front weight. Uh, 405 kilogram front weight. The 585 kilogram front weight. 765 kilogram front weight. I hate how it does that. 945 kilogram front weight. And then back to standard. Christmas candy colors. <laughs> Okay, let's see. Wheel brand, you got Trailborg, you got Nikian, Michelin. Trailborg, you have Standard, you have wheel weights, you have wide tires, wide tires plus weights, and back to Standard. Thank you, Ryan. Thank you. Remember, guys, if you have any questions, just put them in the chat, and I'll try to answer them about the mods, about the mods. The one question we cannot answer, though, today is, is why does mods come out today? <laughs> Because <laughs> it's 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 a, it's a really good question. Because we don't yeah. have a definite answer to that. <laughs> I mean, I could probably you know sit there and try to message Chris. Uh, wait, you know I'm gonna message Chris see what see if he answers. I don't think they're in. Yeah, but uh, he's probably online. I'm thinking maybe. Let's see, is he online? Um, Chris, yeah, he's online right now. Interesting. Yeah, he's... By chance, I thought, oh, I'm going to go and have a quick look. And thank God you did, huh? <laughs> I'm, I'm, yeah, I'm pretty sure, like, not many people are mad about mods still coming out, so. Oh, oh wow. This ain't part of their 25 days of Christmas still, is it? No, this is not the, uh, this is definitely not the advent calendar. Because Advent Calendar usually oh, okay. is just one mod, and it's you, who who's that group that usually brings them out? The uh, Agritechnic, or whatever it is. Oh, oh okay. Agritechnic Nord Eiffel. Yeah, I'll let you say that whole thing. <laughs> Agritechnic Nord Eiffel. <laughs> Ryan. Okay. By the way, guys, we need 15 more likes to hit that 100. Come on, guys. It's been 13 minutes. Let's see if we can hit it in 15 minutes. There's 162 people watching. I don't get why some of you guys are awake, though. It is Christmas break, but that's besides the point. Okay, anyways, fenders. We got front fenders. We got no fenders. Uh, let's see. Beacons. You got no beacons. Left beacon, right beacon, dual beacons, and back to no. The engine setup. You got the T5-100, which is 99. The T5-120, which is 120. The T5-120 Echo Tune, which is 150. So I'm going to go up to 150 horsepower. You have front loader attacher, yes or no. Or Alu, actually, too. Monitors, you got no monitors. You got PLM, that's different. Uh, Intel View IV, 
And then back to no monitors. Hmm, not bad. Okay, let me actually get two of these real quick so you guys can see them in the game. Uh, let's see. Oh, that's something I did notice on this one. This don't have a uh, three points linkage on the front. Okay, what she just said. Yeah. <clears throat> okay, let's get that one. Let's get that monitor real quick. Bless you at work. Well, I figured like, you know, doing like live streams on these is a little bit easier for I can get this out a lot faster and you guys can actually see the mods a lot faster in the game. Okay, uh, doesn't mean that we're going to be speaking uh, plain sense, though, because, you know, it's still early in the morning. Let's see if I get a message yet. <laughs> Chris, Chris messaged me back. <laughs> Guess what he said? He, Surprise! He said, no. Then he put a link, and then it says, says here, and his tongue's sticking out. <laughs> <laughs> So, what are the mods today? So, don't don't expect this probably constant on this break. Oh, I wouldn't expect it. I'd, I'd say today's probably yeah. a one-off. Yeah, maybe, maybe they had it scheduled or something like that from Friday. Might have. Okay, the reason I'm in school is because I am fully remote. Oh, okay. Who are the three people that disliked? I don't know. By the way, we just hit 100 likes. So thank you guys. 100 likes in less than 15 minutes. That is amazing. Okay, but anyways, let's get inside of this. Uh, let's see. We got selecting camera. So here is the interior. Also with the new monitor. The new monitor kind of looks a little bit blurry to me. I don't know if it looks blurry to you guys, but it's the odd one out. Okay, he had this to say. Nobody should expect mods during our Christmas break. <laughs> okay, so guys, this might be just a one-time coincidence right here that mods came out, okay? So don't expect mods during okay. Christmas break. Okay. Anyways, here is the tractor. Let's see. We got that. We got the horn. Standard horn. Uh, rotate crane tool right. So the door does open on that one. Okay, let's turn it over. Four dislikes, why? I don't know. Okay, so here's the interior. Everything lights up. Let's turn back over. Yep. Lights up. I think that that thing right there is just a static, basically, display. Yeah. I'm kind of. So. I, 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 I'm not really into that static display. Okay, let's see. Everything moves, little mm -hmm. pedals, all that. Speed works on there and kilometers. I wish one day they would have, you know, miles per hour on there. That's just me. Hey, Jim Bob. What's up, Jim Bob? Okay. Hey, Jim Bob. So here's the tractor. I like this tractor besides the static display. Top speed is 32 miles an hour. Or over there in the UK, it's 32 kph. I'm surprised that they don't. Miles an hour. I'm surprised they haven't done a conversion. You know that. That it's, you know it's, I it's think exactly the same. If you can change it from kilometers to miles per hour. Yeah, but it's it's not right because no matter what, it's yeah. it's still gonna be saying 32 kilometers per hour. Ah. Small frame on the tractor. Yes. Hey, what's up, Ethan? How you doing, buddy? So that is the new Holland T5. Not too bad of a tractor. Like I said, I don't like the static display though. Uh, where is FS Daily News? That will be after this video. All right. But there is that one. So next one we got is another tractor, and this is the Fultra T-Forest Pack. So where is this app? Maybe in large tractors? Vultra T-Series, Vultra T-Series. Nope. Small tractors? Yes, there. Wait, no, that's not it. <laughs> Marshall. Okay, uh, is this just a, uh, hold on. Is this just a Walter T-Series pack? No, it does have one. Okay, so where is it? It's not in there, not in large tractors. I did activate it, right? I hope. <laughs> I don't think I activated it. I hope so. <laughs> let, me, uh, let me go back out real quick. Okay. 
So we're gonna go back out real quick to see if we activate it. You guys wanna see how fast that, you know, the Xbox Series X actually goes from the this screen all the way to the beginning? Watch this, okay. One, two, three. That's how fast it goes back to the menu. That's faster than my PC goes back to the menu. Okay, uh, let's go back over here. Okay, Voltra, what do I need? Voltra T-Series. <laughs> like Ryan, Ryan, he's like, holy crap. <laughs> exactly. Okay, so did I, I did activate it. So where is it? Is it not? Oh, it, I'm wondering if they put the tractor in the forest section. I bet you they did. Right, we... It's faster than my Xbox One. Yeah, look how fast it just loaded up. Yeah, I think it's a forestry tractor. Yeah, it probably is a forestry tractor. But it's just weird yeah. seeing a tractor actually in there. Okay, so let's go <laughs> right over here. Let's go to forestry machines. And yep, there it is. Okay, we got the T Forest, which is $175,000. Uh, let's see. Oh, I need the new Xbox. Good luck trying to find one. No, right now I am on the new Xbox Series X, which is pretty much the same thing as consoles. There is no difference between this one and your guys' version one. The only difference is maybe faster loading. That's about it. Yeah. Because they haven't optimized or anything like that. Let's see. Uh, this is 15 slots, 210 horsepower. Options on this one. We got design color. This is actually a nice tractor, though. I wouldn't mind this as just a regular tractor. Uh, we got any color. What so is it looking at? Uh, the Voltra T Series Forest Pack. Oh, yeah. yeah. Uh, let's see. So you got any color you want, design color. So of course you can have it as hey, Chance's Sam. pink, and then main color as Sam's purple. Right, Sam? <laughs> <laughs> I guess we scared him off. It's okay. We have that effect. Okay, rim color. You can have any color. That actually doesn't look too bad, if I'm actually being honest. My daughters would probably no, no. love this tractor. <laughs> okay, let's see. Yeah. Will Brand, you have Trailborg, you have Nakian, Trailborg, you have white tires, white tires plus weights, chains, and then back to white tires, white tires plus weights and chains. Uh, you love? I don't love pink and purple. I'm actually tired of pink. Everything with my daughters is pink, 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 pink. Okay, let's see. Fenders, you got no or yes. Engine setup, you got the T194, the T234, which is 250, Wow, the T458, 475 horsepower. That is amazing right there on a Voltra. Yes, the interior changes color. Oh, I, yeah, I did notice that. So the design color right here, the uh, interior changes. So put it like that green right there. Actually, not bad. Okay, uh, let's see. What other options do we got on this? We got front loader attacher, yes or no. Forest cage, no or yes right there. So let's actually get this one real quick. Okay, so there's that. I believe there's also an attachment thing that comes with this. So let's go over to the forestry section. You like chances pink in the inside? Okay, so where is forestry equipment? There it is. Go all the way to the end. There it is right there. The skidding crane, which is 12 slots, 8,500. It does require 70 horsepower on this one. You also got design color on this one. So, of course, let's put it for pink and then main color as purple. There we go. And let's get that one real quick. And, of course, the train has to drive by. Doesn't he know I'm doing a video? What the hell? <laughs> no, I don't think it does. Standard procedure. You were on it, but yeah. it went past it. What do you mean by that? Oh, talking about the forestry equipment. Okay, so here it is right here. See, I, I like this tractor. Not bad looking tractor. So my mod I sent last week, it says console testing, so it won't come out till the new year now, right? Probably. That's all I'm going to say. Uh -huh. Hold on a second. What are we waiting for? What are oh, you I'm, I'm texting Chris back. Mm -hmm. Oh, oh okay. <laughs> mm -hmm. 
He says, the blog says, the answer is no, there is no mods, just like last year. <laughs> okay, how much does the mods cost? They're free. All mods are always free. If you're talking about in the game, I've been telling you guys the price. Uh, this one was what? I believe... Yeah, $175,000. Okay, so let's get in here real quick. Okay, let's see. We got horn. Then we got steering mode. We have... Okay, transport position off or transport position on. That's different. Uh, change driving directions, so you can actually change the driving directions on it. Um, that is it on that one. Okay, let's turn it over. Everything lights up on it. Dashboard all lights up with the lights. One, two, three. Three sets of lights, beacons, turns. Jeez, train. You hearing this? Jeez. Okay, uh, we have a vulture just like that, but different color. Okay, right, so here is the crane on it, which everybody knows I'm really good with cranes. Okay, what does the transport <laughs> position mean? Uh, let's see. Now it's not even up there oh, anymore. No. Hold on. Steering mode. There we go. Okay, what is... <laughs> I don't know... I might have to get inside and see what it does. I don't... Yeah, I don't see a difference at all with the driving oh. or anything like that. I don't know. Uh, con oh, there is also a crane cam. So when you get the crane on here, there is a crane cam. Consoles should be able to turn. No, you cannot turn them on. Okay, so let's go over here. Let's see what this is. Crab block off or crab block on. Okay, I don't know exactly what that did. Turn on the what? Yes, how about that Chiefs win? Okay, so there's that opening. Actually, this ain't too bad to handle right here. I can do this one. Yeah, not too bad. Extending, up, down. Rotating. Yeah, this is that's actually pretty easy. Oh, okay, and that controls that right there. Uh, no, he doesn't, Joe. Hey, Joe, how you doing, buddy? He says, do you ever sleep? What's the sleep you talk about? Okay, so this is a nice little mod right here. What do you guys think about this one? <laughs> okay. <laughs> Pretty cool. It is not Coke time. It is, I'm drinking sweet tea this early in the morning. <laughs> I'm drinking coffee. I probably should have grabbed a cup of coffee. Okay, but that right there was the Voltra Tea Forest Pack. Um... All right, let's see. Next one we have is the Lizard 20208, which is... What is that exactly? It's too early in the morning for this. Oh, okay, that is... Let's go over that real quick. Give me a second. You should get a coffee. Come bring me a coffee. <laughs> okay, let's see. Let's go over here. You're going to do mods and maps review soon? I'm doing the mod review right now. Okay, let's see uh, where we're at. Belt systems. There is the new conveyor belt system. That's the Lizard T20208. Let's see. Uh, six slots on that. 2,500 liters. And this actually doesn't look like it can hold anything. I mean, it doesn't look like it's pretty much anything can be held on it. It just says manure. looks like straw, uh, silage, grass, pretty much... Just regular stuff. You, you can change the main... The BGA she can't tip into. Yeah. It actually doesn't look too bad. Let me actually get one of these real quick just to see if it has automatic on it. See if you can actually enter it. Yes, you can. Whoa. Um, the camera is, like, broken on it. Um. <laughs> Whoa. <laughs> Derp, I think I broke it. Oh, that was scary. Let me see. If I, I can't. I can't get out of it. Uh. <laughs> okay, guys. I think I found a bug on this. Uh, <laughs> this mod. I think so. Um, it's nice nonetheless from this angle. <laughs> <laughs> I, I, I can't do anything else different. Let me see if I can get another one. See if I can get it to work a lot better. 
Okay, so let's go ahead and reset this one. Pull it with a tractor. No, it's just like that. Oh, well, I hope it's not. Okay, there we go, right there. Oh, as soon as you move down, that's what it does, though. Uh, <laughs> oh, that that's bad if it does that every single time. Okay, you can't switch to it. Okay, let's try this again. Okay, don't move down. No, not down. Okay, so whenever you're doing like this, it works perfectly. Let me see if you go down, though. See? Don't move down with your camera on this. This is exactly what it will do. Oh, so they're going to have to fix that bug on there. Let me get one real quick just so I can show you guys it working at least. Okay, so here it is. Let's see. Unfold belt. So that is it. Unfolding. Turn on belt. Probably got to turn on the engine. Oh, you don't have to turn on the engine. Okay, I just turned it on. Nothing's happening. So does it only work whenever... I guess it might only work whenever you have something in it. You can see better like that? No, you can't. Get out of here with that. Okay, but there is the lizard. Uh, I'm going to have to fix this one. Lizard T20208. All right, so let's get rid of this real quick. So I would be careful with the camera on this one. Okay, the next one, the Brussels Unlaid Square Bale. Uh, it's right over here, probably under front loaders. Right there. <laughs> Sam's in here. Hey, Sam, how you doing, buddy? Okay, so let's see. This thing is $16,000, four slots. Let's see, options on this one. We got main color, any color. And attacher type, front loader, tele loader, wheel loader, and then back to front loader. So that is this one, the Brussels Unlaid Square Bale. Okay, the next one after that one, we have the Sledge, which is $100. It is one slot, and yeah. There we go, right there. I'm wondering how this thing actually can... I'm, wait, where did it go? I thought I re... Oh, it's right there, okay. Look how small this thing is. Oh, this just feels right right here, guys. You know, it just feels right. Mm -hmm. Okay, is how can I get this to see if it works on multiplayer? Um, Sam, can you join? <laughs> I want to see if see if it works on multiplayer. If someone can actually get in it, then someone can be behind it. But I highly doubt it works like that. But we're about to find out. Yes, guys, if you guys haven't already done it, make sure you guys do hit that like button. We're almost up to 150 likes. Okay, so there's that. See, I, I, there's no way for me to, you know, basically put this, like, with the worker or anything like that. Oh, wait. Maybe there is. Let's see. But he can't strap it to a horse. <laughs> okay, I think I figured out a way to do this. Let's see. To see if we can get it to work like this. Okay, what we do is we get one of these. We get a mower. Oops. Get a front mower. This is just me trying to think outside the box a little bit. <laughs> Okay, let's see. We're at 153 hey, likes. 47. Good morning. Oh, hey, Joe. Good morning. You're finally here for the morning show. <laughs> <laughs> you didn't get enough sleep last night? Yeah, plenty. It's what, 25 to 5 at the end of here. <laughs> this, this should be our regular time streams, right? That way you're like, you can actually get some sleep for once. Yeah. Okay, let's see if this works. I don't, I don't know if this is going to work, guys. I'm just trying this out. Because I've got multiplayer on here. Okay, so what I'm going to do is I'm going to try to hire a worker, have him go, and then I'm going to try to... Am I... Am I... My person's not on there. But it's still working, though. Look. <laughs> ah! <laughs> what the hell? <laughs> I found my... This is hands down one of my favorite mods now. <laughs> this is awesome. 
<laughs> hey, 40. You know, just riding on a sled behind the tractor. <laughs> I love this no. thing. <laughs> this right here would wake you up in the morning. <laughs> yes, it would. You know, going about 13 miles an hour on grass with someone mowing in front of it. <laughs> but I know what I'm doing tonight when we're live streaming. <laughs> I'm going to have Sam and them sitting there doing all the work. I'm just going to be riding behind them. Move it. Move it. <laughs> You need to change your name. Yeah. Oh, yeah. That's a that's a very bad name. So this right here, guys, this is a mod to keep your workers in check. <laughs> <laughs> yeah. No, it's an we're going to do some more farming simulator. Oh, yeah. There is the sledge. I'm just going to let it keep working. You can keep cutting the grass right over here. <laughs> I love that thing. Okay, the next one we got is a plow. So let me get all the way over here and we'll show off that plow real quick. <laughs> Love that mod. <laughs> we should have a bigger low loader for console. Uh, we do got some pretty nice low loaders, though. Even on console. Imagine putting that behind the CA50 and telling 9RX to giddy up. <laughs> That's like telling the big bud to giddy up. Yeah. <laughs> The teacher, the sled, the kid is the tractor. Okay, let's see. Okay. Oops, I didn't mean to save a screenshot. That's the thing about the new Xbox Series X controllers. They got a button like right here. When if you press it, it takes a screenshot. If you hold if you I think if it's if you hold it down, it takes a little clip. Okay. Uh -huh. Who changed the name? Oh, they're talking about that the P word. Yeah. That's <laughs> like a little kid. Change the P word. Okay, but anyways, let's see. We have the PLN 532 and, yeah, uh, little plows. Let's see, four slots apiece, 2,500 for the big one and 2,250 for the smaller one. Yep, Cyberpunk was pulled from PlayStation. Was not pulled from the Xbox. I didn't even mean to upload that. Dang it. Uh, but they did put a warning on the Xbox store saying something about, uh, basically if you have the last gen consoles to be aware that you're going to have performance issues on it. <laughs> That's what I'm saying, 40. <laughs> okay. Let's see. 130 horsepower is required for the smaller one. 150 for the bigger one. We got 1.4 meters and 1.8 meters options. You got any color pretty much on here. Attacher type, you got standard, you got under right, and then back to standard. Harrows, you got no or yes on that one. It's probably going to be the same options for this one. It is. Uh, can you pick up the sled or no? That is a good question. Thank you for answering that. See, this is why I like doing live streams like this. Because I also get to answer some questions. And questions that I didn't even think about. Okay, so let's see if you can actually pick up the sled. Doesn't look like it. No, you can't pick up the sled. Yeah, there hand icon doesn't even show up. So yeah, you can't even pick it up at all. Oh, I know you play on PC, but I play on PC and Xbox. So, all right, the next one after that one, we have some buildings to go over. We have one that is called exactly buildings. <laughs> so let's go over and find these buildings. Okay, where is this buildings? Uh, let me actually take a look real quick. Buildings, 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 machinery sheds. Where is buildings under? Decorations, maybe? Oh, okay. Why is it under objects? Huh. <laughs> objects? I, I don't know where this building is located at. Oh, there it is right there. It's a building with cows. Okay, $35,000, 37 slots, 12, uh, 12 cows. It can only hold $100 a day on this one. And yeah, let's just put it right over here. So I don't get in the way of, you know, the sled. <laughs> Look at the sled moving backwards. Well, I'm telling you right now, 
If someone was on that sledge right now, they wouldn't be having a very fun time. Not one bit at all. No. <laughs> I'd, be so, I'd be so scared of the tractor running over me. Okay, let's see. So here is buildings right here. I have 840 million. Jeez. Talk to you later, Austin Modding. All right, so let's see if that opens up. It Open up. Okay, opens up pretty slow. Wow, this is a very closed-in area right here. I don't, hopefully, you don't got to put nothing in there. Okay, it looks like slurry right over here. Manure probably goes in right there. The gate opens right here. And we can get a few cows. Let's just get as many as it can hold. So there it... Whoa! Okay, this building's possessed. Building's possessed. <laughs> a cow's floating. Oh. <laughs> <laughs> okay, let's see. These should all open up, right? Oh, no. Oh, wait. Yeah, they do. They open up. Okay, so that opens up. That opens up. Thank you, Casey. Okay. I drink coffee. I want coffee. So, actually, I like how how this actually has, like, a uh, like a storage area for your vehicles, too. So, it's not just, you yeah. know, a building for your cows. Okay, all these doors open up, so definitely got plenty of room in here. And there's your cows. Uh, does that door even... Yes, every single door opens up on here. Yup, new mods today. You'd probably be asleep right now, <laughs> Joe. So somebody, somebody must be still working on it. I guess. I, I don't... Well, I talked to Chris, and Chris said pretty much don't expect this. Because, uh, yeah, they're not supposed to be releasing mods, so... This might be just a once in a thing. Those doors even up. Hmm. Jeez, they made it so every single door in this place can open up. And now I'm in wow. the rafters. Okay, uh, there looks like there is no light. Well, there's light right there. I just don't see a light switch. Maybe right here? Yes, okay. There. Okay, nice. This is actually a nice building. I wasn't too keen on the, you know, the cow part, but the other part of it's really nice. Oh, you got your milk right there. What was that, Joe? This kiddo was just asking me the time. It was 4.42 p.m., kiddo. Mm -hmm. I wish you could move this ladder over to over here so you can actually climb up there. Uh, The only problem is I have no clue where you would even feed your cows. Does that door open up, too? Yes, it does. Oh, there's more cows in here. Oh, that looks like it, that's your feeding trough right here. Okay, I can't even get above these cows. There's too many of them. <laughs> All right. When is the next live stream? That will be tonight. So pretty much to... Let me close this door real quick. Uh, where is... Not in there. Let me close this door real quick. Let me open up this one. Okay, so to probably feed your cows. Or actually to give them water. Because that looks like a water trough. Basically just back up a water trailer right here. And you should be able to uh, give them water. I don't know where you have to feed them. Okay, so that is buildings. That is the first placeable for today. The next one is machinery sheds, which are these two right here. We have a $75,000 one, $125,000 one. Uh, four slots for the smaller one, seven slots for the bigger one, $10 a day for this one, and 15 for that one. Yes, uh, Merry Christmas to everyone. If, if I'm not able to say it during, you know, Christmas Day, Merry Christmas, guys. Okay, big machinery shed. So there's those two. Wow, these are these look really nice, actually. So that door opens. That door opens. These are some really big sheds. Uh, there looks like there is lights in here, but I don't see a light switch. Oh wait, there it is, right there. Lights on. There we go. So there's the for first storage area. Okay, yeah, guys, we're up to 176 likes. We need 24 more likes to hit that 200 goal. So come on, guys. We can hit it. We only got this mod to show off and one more mod after this to show off. Okay, this one is more of a drive through one if you want to. So that door opens. That door opens. What is this switch for? Light on. Oh, that's for the outside lights. Okay. And then this one should be for the interior lights, right? Yep. There it is right there. We're up to 182. Come on, we gotta hit it. Gotta hit it. FS19 PC or console. This is, of course, for console, guys. Th this version I'm showing right here. There's lights also out here, so probably for this light switch. 
Yep. Can you do it longer? Do well longer. Remember, we're also going to be streaming tonight, too. So, there is that. Okay, so we got one more building to go over real quick. And that should be under miscellaneous. And that is the Kloss Baseline HD, which this is... This is one of those GPS things that help you with the precision farming. Makes workers use less lime, less seed, stuff like that. It is only 5,900. It is five slots on that. Okay, let's see. Oh, there are too many objects of this type. Please sell some first. What? Uh, did it? Uh, what did it do to my game? I think if you don't have farming on it, it locks it up. I, di I do have the front precision. Oh, wait. No, I didn't turn it on, did I? God dang it. No. It's too early for you. It's way too early. Yeah. And now my game's locked up. See, this is what happens whenever you don't... Uh... Yeah. Hold on. Let me get into the game again. Oh, I gotta have the precision farming on. Gotta have it on. See, this is what happens when you don't. See, I'm, I, I knew it wasn't gonna work. I just was showing you guys. <laughs> I would get mods for FS20 for mobile. You can't. <clears throat> we are experiencing te technical difficulties. Thank you, Jacob. I need something to drink. I need coffee. <clears throat> okay, there we go. Sorry, I had to clear my throat yeah, real already. quick. Okay, let's go back over here. Let's make sure the precision farming is activated. So, where is it at? Where is it at? Where is it at? Where is it at? It wasn't activated. I am not drinking no Code Red. By the way, we need eight more likes. Only eight more likes until we hit that 200. I'm on second pot of coffee. I need some kind of coffee. I haven't had no coffee, so... Is this Christmas present from Giants? Uh, I don't know. I guess they just... Uh, these were probably like just the backlog of mods that were probably scheduled from Friday. Okay, let's see. Let's try this again. Okay, so let's go over to here. Let's go into miscellaneous. Go over to the baseline, uh, class baseline HD, which is pretty much a cheaper version of those. Five slots. It is more slots than these, so... It's really what you really want. I mean, these aren't too bad. Mainly when this one has a storage area. Uh, so let's go ahead and place one real quick. And there it is right there. So all that does is pretty much... Uh, it doesn't even say on here what it does. Yes, the station provides your vehicles with better GPS signal. This helps your AI helpers to drive more precise and do their work faster. Okay. Okay. Oh, we just hit 200 likes, so thank you, thank you, thank you, guys. Thank you. Okay, also Here today, we guys, <clears throat> we also did get some new updates for today. So the updates for today, oh, we yeah. got, let's see. We got an update for the Lizard Trek 600 by Black Sheep Modding. What did this update do? Added crawler design. So now you can get a crawler on the Trek 600. Uh, altered interior and exterior. Stump grinding is now faster. Improved ease of use and adjusted cutting width on that one. Which I love the Trek, so. Uh, let's see. The Crone Swajo 2000. What did this change? Let's see. Improved AI work areas. Minor model, model adjustments. And strobe light configuration title and naming improved on that one. Okay, after that one. Okay, sorry about that. Okay, after that one, we have the crop storage. What did this fix on it? Let's see. Raised mod desk number. Added user attribute to tip coil on that one. Okay, then we have, let's see, the root crop storage, which is made by 20 Nor MM Normandy 2. And it's the same stuff on this. Raised mod desk number and added a user attribute to tip coil on that one. And then the last update for today was for machinery shed. So all three of these updates on the buildings are from the same Arthur. And it did the exact same thing for this one too, so... There is the updates, and there is the new mods for today. Okay, let's see. Uh, let me get that back up, that back up. 
Okay, so tonight, guys, we will be live streaming probably on console again. We'll probably be on the uh, old farm countryside and getting finished with the rice harvest and all that good stuff. Uh, let me know, let me know, guys, which is your guys' favorite mod for today. I'm probably gonna have to say, I'm gonna have to say the sledge. <laughs> I love the sledge. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> Oh, do, do you guys want to see the treads real quick? I can show you the treads. I just had to activate it real quick. Uh, let me actually save this real quick. I can show you the treads. I mean the treks. Sorry. Uh, let's see. Let's go back over here. Let's go to the T T Rex. Should be right down here. Somewhere over here. Oh, I have it downloaded. Hold on. I presume it's eight thirty tonight, is it? Mm-hmm. Oh, the lizard tricks. Okay, yeah, it's yeah, it's eight thirty tonight. Tonight. What time is your live stream? Eight thirty p.m. Central Standard Time, guys. That's why I ask, because I've seen all the comments. <laughs> yes. Oh, I love the tricks. One of the easiest ways to get rid of trees, if you don't feel like cutting them down. Yeah. Uh, let's see. Lizard, 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 lizard. We got lots of lizards. There it is. Okay, let's go in here real quick. I've been killing trees left and right, up and down. <laughs> you passed it up. <laughs> okay, also, guys, we're at 214 likes. So we got probably about 10 more minutes left of the stream, and then we'll probably be calling it a stream. Like I said, it's a short stream. It's basically just to show you guys the new mods, stuff like that. Uh, let's see. Let's go over here. Okay, uh, let's go to the right here. I believe it's under forestry section. Oh, that's an off There it, There it is right there. Okay, so now some of the new stuff. Let's see, models. That just does that. But we should have... Okay, what was the new stuff on it? Hold on. Wrong button. Wrong button. Okay, uh, Trex has now... It says added crawler design. So probably this one right here, the wide tires one, I'm guessing. Uh, let's go right here, right here, right here. Shut the door this time. Do what? Okay, let's see. Let's get this real quick. And bring this over here. I didn't mean that. Come on. Reset. Oh, yeah. So here it is. It also says it has a, a bigger width now for it. So you guys don't know what this thing is. It's one of the best ways to get rid of a tree. Look at that. Whoa. Okay. They they sped it up a lot. <laughs> Jeez. You just run <laughs> through trees now. What the hell? <laughs> <I don't know. laughs> Dang. Jeez. <laughs> oh, Takes the stump and all real quick as well now, does it? Yeah. Yeah. It drive me mad when I what didn't take the stump. <laughs> That's awesome, can't wait. This will make life a lot easier. I'm gonna go over here. Okay, let, let's see how fast I can race the forest. <laughs> <laughs> I'm ready to do some logging. This ain't logging, this is a race to some trees. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> this is nowhere near logging. <laughs> You know who's gonna love this? Sam's gonna love this, because I know he likes to, you know, expand his uh, Lone Oak map. So, and he's definitely gonna love it since he's a tree killer. He killed Lone Oak. We won't forget. <laughs> we will never forget, guys. Nope. Okay, so we got like a little forest over here. Okay, I should say we had a little forest over here. Okay, <laughs> let's see how fast this thing works. Turn it on. Don't even have to lower it or nothing. Look at this. Just. Oh, look, a tree's in my way. Not anymore. <laughs> okay, it does have problems with some of them, but not as much. Look at this. Just. He just driving through the forest. Just, you know, racing trees. Oh, that tree's in my way. Won't be. This <laughs> is. Yeah, he did. they definitely sped it up. Wow. Okay, I'm having a problem. There must be a rock rock or something right there. I don't know what's right there. 
Oh, okay. I think it's those oh, so, oh, so floating there, trees, I there, think. There is a, st a stump, so they do leave sometimes know. stumps behind. Yeah, but so still, yeah, this is so much more faster. Look at this. Just yeah. Is Lone Oak getting the update? I don't think so. Where is the Lone Oak? I am not cutting down the Lone Oak, guys. You guys want me to cut down the Lone Oak? <laughs> no, I'm just playing. I'm not going to cut it down. No. <laughs> oh, yeah, that Christmas tree I had. <laughs> oh, mine. <laughs> We're not racing the Christmas tree either. It's four days from Christmas. We can't do that. That's what I got on my Stone Valley. The Christmas tree? Yes. Awesome. Yeah, see, this thing's just like running right through these like they're nothing. And look how high I have it up. This ain't bad. <laughs> it's no more having to, you know, like wait like five minutes for a tree to be cut down. True. Oh, that one, jeez. I'm stuck. No. Come on. There we go. I don't know now. Now I th I think that this update might be the best one now. I actually think this this might beat the sledge. I know it's sad, but I'm seriously thinking that it, it might beat the sledge. I mean, look how fast I just pretty much just raced a forest. Yeah. Jeez, this thing's crazy. Wow. <coughs> Talking about an easy way to clear out your land. True. Look how fast I just cleared out that whole area right there. <laughs> oh, look, baby Christmas trees. Oh, it's not going to cut through these, though? Nope, it's not cutting through these. Okay, why isn't it going through those, though? I don't know why it's not going through those. It goes through the, all, all the other stuff but those little trees. Hmm. And that tree's just messed up. That bush is. They're untouchable. It must be. So be careful of the small trees, guys. They're untouchable. Oh, look at this tree over here. We forgot to cut this one down. No, not that one. <laughs> no, not that one. <laughs> that one's definitely untouchable. This one's definitely untouchable? <laughs> yeah. Not the lone oak. Yeah, not the lone oak, man. Okay, guys, do you guys think we should cut the lone oak down or keep it up? <laughs> Can't touch this. No, keep it. <laughs> yes, cut it down. Yes. You leave a monster tree to get rid of the baby Christmas trees. That'll do it. <laughs> Everybody's oh. saying cut it. Cut it, Jack. Cut it, cut it, cut it, cut it, cut it, cut it, cut it. <laughs> I'm never going to hear the end of it if I cut it, though. True. Sam and them are going to be, it's going to be switched from Sam to me. Yeah. Okay, guys, so that is going to be the live stream. <laughs> Next live stream, you can see if we cut down Lone Oak. <laughs> I'd laugh if your map disappeared. That'd be hilarious. <laughs> Get down the tree, all of a sudden, my whole game just goes, Kroosh, crashes. I am not going to cut down the Lone Oak. I promised I would never cut that thing down. I'm not cutting it down. Okay, guys, that is the new mods for today. Let me know down in the comment section below what you guys think. What is your favorite mod for today? Mine has to be the update for the Lizard Treks. Definitely. Yeah. Uh, this might be the last new mods until January, so... Uh, hopefully you guys have an amazing day. Remember guys, I have FS Daily News coming out later and then tonight at 8.30 p.m. Central Standard Time back to a live stream. So have an awesome day guys.
Peace. Bye.